Summer Olympics are in full swing, which means sports fans have lots to celebrate and argue about online. So here to fill us in on who deserves gold and groans this week is Nike Show contributor Francesca Ramsey with another installment of Hash It Out. Thanks, Larry. This year's U.S. women's gymnastics team made us all proud by taking home the gold for team all around. But before we could even start celebrating this epic win, Twitter had a meltdown because Gabby Douglas didn't put her hand over her heart during the national anthem. Take a look at some of these tweets. If Gabby Douglas is not patriotic enough to honor her country, then she needs to find another sponsor and go home with them. Not patriotic enough? Homegirl literally did backflips wearing our nation's flag <laughs> covered in rhinestones. <laughs> And I don't care what you say, sir, there is nothing more patriotic than a choreographed tribute to the Bedazzler. <laughs> How dare Gabby Douglas not put her hand on her heart for the American national anthem? Hashtag kick Gabby out of the Olympics. <laughs> kick her out of the Olympics? Ugh, there is no way this guy could get any worse. Or so I thought, until I saw his Twitter profile. <laughs> but I guess I'm not surprised that a Trump supporter wants to deport a brown person doing work he's not qualified to do. <laughs> Look, she's completely showing respect by standing there proudly during the national anthem. How about you show some respect for somebody who made it possible for the national anthem to be playing in the first place? Yeah. And maybe, maybe Gabby's arms were tired. Do you know how much energy you expend doing Olympic level gymnastics? <laughs> Hell, this is me after walking up four flights of stairs. <laughs> National anthem backlash wasn't even the worst of it. Twitter took the gold medal in petty when people started dragging Gabby for her hair. I just want a black girl to do Gabby Douglas's hair, bro. That's it. Guess what, bro? A black girl did Gabby's hair. Gabby. <laughs> How does Gabby Douglas' mother even let her be on national television with those edges looking like that? Gabby Douglas got money and them edges horrible. No, what's horrible is them grammar you got. Okay. Let me just explain edges. Edges is another word for hairline. And when it comes to black women and hair, edges are a big deal. Do you have them? Did Beyonce, Beyonce snatch them with her fierceness? It's pretty serious stuff. So why are people criticizing Gabby's edges? Well, according to Twitter, they don't look nice enough for the Olympics. Gabby's competing in the Olympics, not a hair show. You try doing the uneven bars routine with a helicopter on your head. <laughs> it's nearly impossible. If Gabby, if Gabby was worried about keeping her edges laid, she wouldn't be at the Olympics. She'd be on the couch talking with you. <laughs> at the Olympics. Plus, your hairline's bound to get a little fuzzy when you're breaking a sweat and breaking world records. All right. Protect the